Well, I got her. Ladies and gentlemen, please say hello to Magnolia, aka Maggie. I just brought her home a few days ago and I am obsessed. I mean, look at her. How stinking cute is she? So I'm just doing a quick cleanup of the inside right now and gonna start moving some stuff inside, but I just wanted to show you guys and take you along. All right, so starting from the back, don't mind this ding. This is what it looks like. I believe under here is propane and the back is just storage. I'm gonna put a little seat back here. Going inside, what we see first is the kitchen area and then the bed and living space and then of course the cab. Um, I love these seats. They're a little broken because, I mean, this car is 47 years old at this point, but I think they're beautiful still. So I think I'm gonna get some seat covers just to protect them um, as much as possible. I do have a Jackery 500 that the previous owner kindly gave me, so I'm just charging this little cordless vacuum right now. This is a speaker and there's a heater. All right, so this is the bed. It is a couch right now, and then it pulls out into a bed. I threw on some sheets that are way too big for it right now, so I did go to the store and buy some full-size sheets. I'm gonna put those on after this. There's a hole here for a table. There's actually two different tabletops, a circular one and a bigger kind of square one. And then from this side, looking down, this is how it looks. So a decent amount of or, uh, cabinet space and there's some counter space here. Um, this is of course the sink, but there's a nice cover that comes on it. So you can just use this as counter space if you're not using the sink, which I probably won't. A propane stove, which does work. A propane heater, which also does work, but I was warned to maybe not, not use it. <laughs> this is the fridge, which does not work. I'm debating taking it out and just creating more cabinet space. But there are quite a few cabinets, you know, kind of under everywhere up here. I need to take off these little Velcro stickies and then throw my own stuff on there. But I'm going to start throwing some stuff in here, put these new sheets on there, and then uh, start sprucing her up. So let's go. Look at Pico watching me. Hi, Pico. <laughs> He's so cute. All right, so from the cab, this is what it looks like with the bed set up. So it's a full-size bed and it comes all the way out to where the kitchen is. And this is it. That's the space. Um, I forgot to mention there's glow-in-the-dark stars in the ceiling and a nice Max Air fan. Very important. I stopped at way too many stores today and picked up some decorative cushions. Very excited about them. So yeah, let's uh, take these tags off. This is what we've got for pillows. Oh my goodness, oh my gosh. <laughs> I got a nice long cream pillow with these cute pom-poms, this nice pastel one with tassels, everything boho-ish has tassels, and then this nice burnt orange sienna colored one also has tassels. I'm trying to kind of have a little variation, some texture, and warm up the space. So I think they did a pretty good job of sprucing it up. Now let's add the rugs. <sighs> Promise I'm wearing pants. So I want three rugs, little just small like accent rugs. I'm going to remove the tags and then see where we can fit them. I just want to continue protecting this floor as much as possible. So 
<laughs> Ooh, this one's soft. So here's the first one. Okay. Here's the second one. This one is 100% cotton, so it's actually machine washable, which is great. Let's see. Okay, and the third one is more jute. Cool. All right, I think I am set for now. The last thing I added was this adorable poof. I knew I wanted a seat back here. So I ended up moving this blue rug back here because it just fits the width perfectly. And then I moved the other two to the front. So no rug in this area for now. Not sure if I'm gonna find anything that fits exactly because it's quite narrow, but I just have these two rugs here. I have the jute one underneath kind of protecting that edge and up to the cab. And then this one is kind of the main one in this front area. This is definitely like the nicest, most cozy one to step on or sit on. So I wanted to have this kind of showing the most. So this is the completed for now, minus this trash, don't look at that. And then the poof and we're at the back.